In this video, we will learn how to create this amazing smoke effect in Photoshop CC 2015.5 by using Photoshop Actions. It will be fun, so let's jump in Photoshop. Welcome back everyone, my name is Dhanan Chaudhary from Tasty Tutorials and uh, today we are going to be creating this amazing smoke effect so it will be fun and it will be really easy for you guys, it's just a single click effect and uh, today we are going to be using this image and uh, let's start our work, what we will need to do is first of all we will go to quick selection tool and give it a selection, so we will select the area which we want to work on so we'll quickly do that and let me tell you one thing that from today i will upload my tutorial right after one day like uh, i am uploading today and uh, after one day i will upload the video as uh, today is thursday and tomorrow is friday so i will upload tutorial after one day like saturday so there will be a one day of gap so i could get more time to work on and uh, uh, I am a student too and my work project is uh, on the way that's why okay so we have created this selection what we need to do is we will create a new layer call it as brush brush in lowercase keep in mind that and what we need to do is next is we'll click and select the area uh, color and press alt plus backspace press ctrl d and it will select the fill the selection and uh, now we need to load brushes so press b from your keyboard to call up your brush to brush tool and click on this care box go to load brushes when you will download your zip file of uh, actions you will extract that and there will be a folder named smoke actions when you will open this there will be a smoke uh, brush file smoke brush file so you need to load this into your uh, brushes so the next step is loading our actions but before loading our actions let me tell you or give you a little information about this work is that your image should be in rgb and 8 bit and uh, 72 dpi and the image uh, uh, scale should be like in high definition it work more nicely so you try to use high definition images it will give you a nice detail so let's just load our actions click on this action let me just close this it was already working okay so go to your this site uh, whatever this is and click on load okay so there will be different of folders for different versions of photoshop so we are good uh, we are using latest version so we'll click on this cc plus click on smoke and load as i already loaded them so i didn't know don't need to load them so then you will click on drop down menu and there will be a smoke uh, named uh, whatever it is called and we will just click on drop arrow so there will be a name you can see that brush so your layer name should be brush because it will be used again and again and again in your composition or process so keep in mind that now let's start our work without wasting your time and click on this action play button it will take a little time so we will skip this work but before it it shows a message that in the next step start brushing where you want to want the smoke to fade off from your subject so brush the area where you want to fade off your effect so brush is already selected so you don't need to select any further brushes and you don't need to create any other layer because it is already uh, created so size it up give it a color sorry uh, if you want a perfect selection so press control and click on this layer now it will create a selection we can say that uh, selection now click you can see that it will only drag it on this uh, we can say scroll so a little here and uh, size it up and maybe a little here on this side on this side so nice okay so we have created our selection what we need to do is next is just need to click on this play button and the long process will be start so click
okay so the process is completed and uh, looks really cool and uh, amazing i really like this thing so what we'll do is we just need to close and collapse this and the next step is click sorry click and uh, control alt and give it a click it will close all of these layers open these uh, adjustments and there are different kind of color options so let's see try this one looks amazing every color is amazing you will really amazed about this and like let's select second one fourth one fifth one sixth one but i would like to go with this this color and if you uh, want your uh, desired color you just need to go to v saturations and give it some colors like you desired like uh, these type of things but its own colors are more uh, accurate for this and uh, that's it uh, the link is given in the description bar you just need to download free of cost because this tutorial is all about you so what you want to be well, what you want to learn about anything else you just need to comment on videos any video i will just kind of try to reply as fast and i will try to create that type of tutorials and uh, please comment so it will be a good feedback for me so i can work more betterly and much nicely so this is Nan Chaudhary. we will meet in our next video and uh, keep in mind never stop and keep learning